Hello everyone, this is GrayShot17 bringing you an update to GrayShot Productions' YouTube channel. Um, this is pretty much going to be an update on what's going on for the next few months, uh, what's been going on with the lack, well, I don't want to say lack, but the delayed content on Patreon, and also a few other things that have been going on both now and also in the future. So, uh, first off, let's get started. Uh, first, let's start with Patreon. I actually today am getting my new editing software so the nice thing is with uh, patreon support it's about hit 75 bucks so i'm like all right finally get it before you're asking great shot why I didn't get beforehand uh very simple even though i could have maybe gotten it before i financially could not uh i just started my new job which i'm not going to say what it is just for security reasons um i started my new job the beginning of september and I didn't get my first paycheck until the beginning of October, which sucked. But thank you guys for your support because that seriously helped me out during my time when I was unemployed. Anyway, now that I actually have that, I can start improving the channel. And I want to not only make, of course, benefits for myself, but also for the uh, viewer. So the editing software is the first step. Next up will be making sure my content is as high quality as I can make it. And how do I do that? Um, I want to make sure that the content the company first two gameplays the any sort of rts gameplay my first person shooter gameplay is the highest quality can for that platform so what am i going to do um for the xbox i i know i play games on xbox and people are like why don't you play it on pc because i have a core community of guys who i play with who are just fantastic and awesome and while i have an equal group on pc they're for a different crowd so in the meantime i'm going to still play siege overwatch halo etc on xbox although i'm what i'm probably going to do is upgrade my console to the newest version of the xbox so i can get a slight performance boost very minuscule but also increase my uh, uh 4k capability for that as well just you know help out on that capacity you know try to g increase quality ever so slightly it's not much but it could help um also that would increase my uh hard drive and hopefully loading for some of those games uh, now, of course, on PC, I'm hopefully going to be 4K capable by the end of the year and beginning next year. What does that mean? Uh, I will start producing content in true 4K. Not upscaled. I will be uh, recording 4K gameplay and then uploading it to YouTube. Now, of quality, but that's my goal. That's a lot of effort. That's my current objective because that's the next big thing I need is to make sure my hardware can deal with this new generation that is currently taking place with VR and stuff like that. Don't expect VR content, but you can expect hopefully Company of Heroes 2 in 4K. And I'm, my goal, and don't hold me to this, but my goal is by the episode 200, once that releases, I start a new series where it is in 4K. That would be my, like, hold my fi oh, fingers crossed, double check, um... GTA has double checked it with him, uh, and so far it's worked pretty great. He has a GTX 1080. I'm hopefully going to try to upgrade as well. And then, uh, if you want to move for my brother, I'll be transferring them my components to him. I know it's a hand me down, but nine, GTX 970 is still a beast. So the fact that I'm upgrading even more is like, yeah, I want, um, you know, Godzilla, you know, he's okay. Let's get Godzilla Meltdown for those who are kaiju fans. Also, be seeing that very soon. Um, so expect that review. Cannot wait. Uh, also on the channel, Civilization VI is going to be coming out. Titanfall, Battlefield, also Gears of War. I will be featuring all of those games on my channel over the next few months. Don't expect Call of Duty. Not a big Call of Duty fan. Although Modern Warfare Remastered, if it goes actually standalone, not what Activision says standalone, as in, uh, yeah, this is a part of the game. Um, once it actually is sold separately, I will play that on the channel because I have fond memories and really, really enjoyed that game. Um, too bad that core group then moved on to Titanfall. But so far, I mean, I love Titanfall, so I can't complain that it's like, well, I used to like Modern Warfare, but too bad. Oh, well. Uh, my thing is just like, it's, and it, even though it actually the Infinite Warfare doesn't look as bad, my initial complaint still stands as it's a very similar status as Ghostbusters, where Ghostbusters had terrible marketing. Terrible marketing. The movie's okay. It's okay. I thought, it, again, it's not great, it's not terrible, but the marketing made that film seem atrocious. And going in that low 
didn't help. It did not help. Um, so moving on from that. All right. A uh, few other side steps. Streaming. I want to start streaming more regularly. Now, if you don't know, my work week consists of seven days of work, which is essentially six days I work and then one day off. And I'm, I'm, there's no way I can stream during that one day. And then because I'm just so exhausted. That's like my <gasps> catch a breath, get all the content I need to done. I can't stream. So my goal is during the week that I do work, try to maybe stream once if I can, but then the week that I don't, stream about two times, two to three times a week. That is my goal. I don't want to, my thing is though, I don't want to stream too much because again, with my content, I've been uh, lacking on CH2. I kind of fell back on that and it's been, tr I've been trying to get back up and uh, make sure my Patreon supporters have at least three videos in which they have early. So I apologize for that trying to get that back up because again that's something that falls back on me on my promise that again release content early uh, uh now that said for future content uh series wise again i'm trying to have let's plays of all of uh titanfall gears of war and um battlefield up when i can and hopefully with great sean friends play but the thing about that is like okay what are you doing with civilization my current goal is actually for my brother and I to do a series on that, and that will kind of interlope, go back and forth with Hearts of Iron. Company of Heroes 2 will still be a, uh, my main platform because, again, most people come to, a lot of people come to my con uh, channel for that content, but Hearts of Iron has done really well. Same thing with my Gracious Friends play with the new format and my and new editing I've been trying to do with that kind of you know, uh, nice, simple, uh, simplify that, nice little edited bits. Uh, Company of Heroes 2, you can watch for an hour. Gracious Friends play, five minutes of just awesomeness. But uh, that's what I try to do. In any case, that will continue. Uh, but what I'm probably going to do is add a Civilization 6 series and then flip back and forth. So Blue Leader will be going crazy because, again, he loves that game. He loves Civilization, if you have not guessed. Uh, other updates. By the time this comes out, there's a Humble Bundle going on with CH2. Uh, if you want CH2, you can get it. This is not saying, go buy it now. But this is me being like, if you're interested in it, you can get all of Company Bureau's. Both the first one and second one for ten bucks. And if you just want to try the first one, you can get it for a dollar. That's a pretty great bargain in my book. If you don't like it, you wasted ten bucks. So guess what? That's like having a bad fast food meal. <laughs> it's it's like, wow, geez, I should have had that Big Mac. But you know what? At, at at least I tried it, or something along those lines. At least I tried it. And for ten bucks, it's not bad. Um, so if you are interested in it, there you go. Uh, other things on my channel of note, uh, oh yeah, so in the next few months as well, not only do I want my setup to be more professional and like for, uh, my game plan and stuff like that, I actually want this background to be more professional. I took down the green screen because I saw the quality, it was just like a little bit staticky. I liked it more uh, than what I previously had with my brother where it was just a blank wall as it is currently right now. Uh, I might have a little scroll scrolling sidebar to over here during this update, but uh, what I want to do is essentially have a professional background for doing reviews and doing stuff, which have more design to it. Uh, my goal is to have like my eventually get a standing desk where I can just stand and uh, then have a discussion with my uh, well, Gray Shot One Five One, and with that I can have like a nice background art in, in the back. Have maybe Gray Shot Productions up top with a few of my favorite. Uh, entertainment series from video games, TV shows, movie, etc. Just decorate the background. Um, the style I want, I'm thinking of is similar to like Glass Reflection or a few other guys. I really enjoy those background styles. Simple, elegant, still works, and it just highlights and gives like an idea of like, what are you in for? Okay, this is what you're in for. Um, so that's my uh, idea for, and hopefully I'll have that done equally by the end of the year. Uh, again, my goal is to have uh, the upgrades done by the end of the year. I don't know. Uh, family stuff is uh, coming up, so that might delay some things. And uh, But yeah, my, go my current goal is the end of the year to have my hardware and background and also workspace upgraded. That way it can hit a higher quality. I am, a, I am though... I'm so happy with how the channel is going. Um, thank you for you uh, for you guys for watching. It's been awesome so far over the past few weeks. I mean, I mean, even though I've been like busy and stressed out with work and everything like that, the channel has been doing really great. I have no complaints, uh, honestly. What I might do is I'm gonna rework maybe the comment show a little bit better. And this is just me personally. I just 
I feel like me saying comments is not I don't think no one wants to watch that. That's my thing. So what I might do is just handpick the best comments and do like a uh, a comment show actually. Like me talking to it and it, having a better workstation or a thing would be better because it, it would be better than me just being like this where it's kind of just a black back. Just having Instead of a green screen behind me, it kind of looks fake. Even though I do want like a green screen from when I do a live stream and also put that up during that. Have something that's more professional and uh, just better. And that's what I'm trying to reach. Just a better level of professionalism because, again, this is my second – if I'm going to treat this as a second job, I'm going to treat it as a second job and try to improve in every way I can. So that's currently the updates on the channel. Uh, don't uh, – sorry again for the delays. Um, even though if you're not a Patreon supporter, you didn't really notice. If you are a Patreon supporter, I do apologize. Uh, but yeah, nice thing is I can start doing more stuff because I have a full-time job. And uh, I've already in the span of the past week kind of already upgraded my personal stuff. So I'm a lot – I like my environment now more so than before, and I have a less I don't have a squeaky chair, which is great. Sorry about that again. Um, but when I do upgrade stuff, I'm gonna make sure it's a higher quality, so you don't have to worry about me getting a fifty. Was no, it wasn't even fifty. It was like a thirty-five dollar Target chair that I just got because again I was broke. I had no money, so I'm like, all right, this will work. Snaps off in half. Thanks, Target. But uh, no, um, I expected it. But honestly, uh, that's it. So I want to thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys have something that you want me to improve upon, something I forgot that you guys have been clamoring about, or anything along those lines, put it down in the comments below, and I will check it out. But otherwise, it's been GrayShot117, and I will see you all next time.